60T RS3, five pellets, four pellet cube, and uh, fifth one is in here. Let's go to GXs, rotate the GXs, see how Charlie. See that here, high 19 C530, front scroll, laser, lasers in here. Two change rates with speed, 6038, 24,000 RPM. Here, 12 uh, inch uh, test bar in there, you just gave 100. And the uh, return is now on the up one, the outside. Let me go a little bit closer, you see this. A very, very good spindle actually. And this indicator is uh, 50 millions, 50 millions indicator. See this here, 50 million indicator. So now we check the bottom. Now here we're checking the RS3 60T, 300 millimeter, 12 inches test bar, also in the bottom. And again, it's a 50 million indicator here, 50 million. And we got about a turn here, it's hard to see. It's about three tenths, so six microns about on the bottom. Full check also, the spindle was changed too, so uh, very nice machine here. Live European machine tool.com. Now we go in C direction, up and down here for the spindle on the test bar, and it's about six tenths, about 14 microns straightness here. See all the way down and all the way up here at the test bar. And uh, go a little bit closer here and see, it's all time hard to see, it's a 50 million indicator. And it's about six tenths in the direction up here. You see this here, about six tenths. And it's about 14 microns in millimeter on 300 millimeter test check. Give the head in 90 degree position and double check the accuracy here. And as we go close again, it's again the same 50 million test bar HSK 63A, 50 million indicator. And we have about two tenths. It's about two tenths, that's five microns of 12 inches or 300 millimeter here. You see this, they move x axis and it's two tenths, okay? That's five microns accuracy. position here and uh, we got the same what we had before in a vertical position here about seven mics six seven microns eight microns you know it's a 50 million indicator here in, uh, 300 millimeter or 12 inches test bar we have the indicator now on the bottom here and we will show you here it's again 50 million indicator 50 million indicator and here it's all live european machine tool.com it's about uh, Two microns and tenths, not even, so about tenths of two microns straightness. This the uh, X X is driving in 90 position here. We see this is all like European machine tool. Going over the table here, you see this. Now we go in the back direction and uh, try to stay near 50 million indicator. We drive over the table, you see that's live European machine tool.com. And it's about how much is it about? Uh, yeah, about one tenth. So two microns over the table, that's coming Y axis out. Y axis over the table, one tenth, okay? So very, very nice. We go also over the table and check that, you know, it's the rotation of the table and the indicator on the head. See that? We got about four tenths. Four tenths. It's about ten microns on a table surface in 360 degrees spinning the rotary table. Now yeah, we go a little bit faster, just increase the overwrite and we make a tool change here. You see that double gripper HSK 63A and it changes zero to a back. We see an RS3 uh, machine, 60T, European machine tool.com. We see four pellets and the fifth pellet is inside the machine area. And uh, each pellet has a system on it for clamping through the pellet by himself. We see this here, the hydraulic lines. And uh, you can clamp a vise or parts in the vise, tombstones, etc., etc. Each pellet system has that built in. So any questions, thank you very much. Have a great day.
It's a DMU 60T RS 2005. We run here 20,000 RPM right now. And uh, you see that spindle, it's a bit quiet actually. And uh, we have the water running here too. Let's uh, check the, the vibration here on the control. You see this, it's 20, let's go 22,000. It's 22,000 RPM here, you see this. And everything is good in the vibration here. We can go also up to 24 quick. Let's go 24,000 RPM. Go 24 here and hit NC start. And you see that here, 24,000 RPM. Here is the spindle here, we have the cabin door closed.